Good evening, Dr. Phil here. Today we will be discussing on the innervation of the leg and foot. Innervation of the foot. Five branches from the sciatic and femoral nerves innervates the foot. All nerves must be blocked if complete anesthesia of the foot is required. From the femoral nerve branches the saphenous nerve. From the sciatic nerve branches posterior tibial nerve, deep peroneal nerve, sural nerve, and superficial peroneal nerve. Posterior tibial nerve or the tibial nerve. At the popliteal fossa, the sciatic nerve divides into the tibial nerve and common peroneal nerve, also known as the common fibular nerve. Tibial nerve Origin Fibers arise from the anterior divisions of L4 to S3 nerve roots of the sacral plexus. Terminal branch of the sciatic nerve at or above the popliteal fossa, it is the largest and most medial branch of the sciatic nerve. Motor supply Posterior compartment of the thigh, posterior compartments of the leg, including gastrocnemius, soleus, popliteus, flexor digitorium longus, flexor helices longus, and tibialis posterior. Muscles of the soles of the foot. Sensory supply. Articular branches to the knee, ankle, and foot joints. Skin of the posterior calf, sole of the foot. Branches. Articular twigs to the knee, ankle, and foot joints. Muscular branches in the posterior compartments of the leg. Sural nerve. Medial sural cutaneous nerve. Terminal branches in the foot. Medial plantar nerve, lateral plantar nerve, and medial calcaneal nerve. Cause After leaving the popliteal fossa, posterior to the popliteal vessels, it enters the calf between the heads of the gastrocnemius and deep to the soleus. The tibial nerve then emerges under the flexor retinaculum in the tarsal tunnel. It passes medial to the Achilles tendon, enclosed in a synovial sheath containing the posterior tibial vessels. It lies behind the posterior tibial artery. It then courses between the flexor digitorium longus tendon and flexor halesis longus tendon. At the level of the medial malleolus, it divides into the medial plantar nerve, lateral plantar nerve, medial calcaneal nerve. Sensory supply of the foot by the posterior tibial nerve. Medial side of the heel by medial calcaneal nerve, which branches off from the posterior tibial nerve proximal to the flexor retinaculum. Medial and lateral sole of the foot as well as bony structures of the mid and forefoot by the medial and lateral plantar nerves, which branches from the posterior tibial nerve posterior to the medial malleolus and deep to the flexor retinaculum. Toes by the plantar digital nerves. Auto supply of the foot by the posterior tibial nerve. Medial plantar nerve supplies the flexor digitorium brevis, adductor helices, flexor helices brevis, first lumbrical. Lateral plantar nerve supplies the adductor digiti quinti, quadratus plantae, flexor digiti minimi brevis, adductor helices, second, third, and fourth lumbricals, dorsal and plantar interossi. Superficial peroneal nerve. At the popliteal fossa, the sciatic nerve divides into the tibial nerve and common peroneal nerve. Common peroneal nerve. Origin. It arises from the posterior division of the anterior rami of the L4 to S2 nerve roots in the sacral plexus. Posterior to the head of the fibula, it divides into the superficial peroneal nerve and deep peroneal nerve. Cause. It descends on the lateral margin of the popliteal fossa deep to the biceps femoris. It exits the popliteal fossa and passes superficial to the lateral head of the gastrocnemius and plantaris. At this level, it is subfacial. It winds around the fibular neck to enter the lateral compartment of the leg. Sensory supply Superior, inferior genicular nerves, recurrent genicular nerves, supply the knee capsule. Lateral sural cutaneous nerve supplies the skin and deep fascia over the upper half of the peroneal and extensor compartments. Superficial peroneal nerve 
supplies the skin on the dorsum of the foot. Deep peroneal nerve gives off dorsal digital nerve to supply adjacent sides of the first and second toes. Peroneal communicating branch forms the sural nerve by joining with the medial sural cutaneous nerve from the tibial nerve. The tibial nerve supplies the posterior lateral side of the leg and dorsal aspect of the lateral foot. Motor supply. Muscular branches supply the short head of the biceps femoris. Deep peroneal nerve supplies muscles of the extensor compartment. Superficial peroneal nerve supplies muscles of the lateral compartment of the leg. Superficial peroneal nerve, aka fibular nerve, a terminal branch of the common peroneal nerve, it arises from L4 to S2 nerve fibers. Course, it lies deep to the peroneus longus, courses along the anterior intermuscular septum in the lateral compartment of the lower leg, it emerges superficially between the peroneus longus posteriorly and extensor digitorium longus, as it descends, it then lies between the peroneus brevis and the fascia. It perforates through the crural fascia and runs anteriorly superficial to the extensor retinaculum between the anterior tibia and the lateral malleolus. Termination. Subcutaneous branches supply the dorsum of the foot and ends as digital nerves. Motor supply. Peroneus longus and peroneus brevis. Sensory supply. Distal anterior leg dorsum of the foot, except a small area supplied by the deep peroneal nerve, which is the adjacent sides of the first and second toes, and the lateral foot, which is supplied by the sural nerve. Deep peroneal nerve Origin It is a terminal branch of the common peroneal nerve under the peroneus longus muscle, it originates from L4 to S2 nerve fibers. Course. It descends in the anterior compartment of the leg after branching out of the common peroneal nerve. It courses medially under the peroneus longus and pierces the interosseous membrane to enter the anterior compartment of the leg. On the anterior aspect of the interosseous membrane, it lies alongside and lateral to the anterior tibial artery. At the ankle, it passes deep to the extensor retinaculum between the two malleoli anterior to the ankle. It lies lateral to the dorsalis pedis artery and lies between the tendons of the extensor helicis longus and extensor digitorium longus. It then crosses the dorsalis pedis to lie medial to it and divides into the medial terminal branch and lateral terminal branch. Sensory supply of the deep peroneal nerve. Recurrent branch supplies the knee. It supplies the ankle joint and the deep peroneal nerve supplies the small area of the skin of the dorsum of the foot between the first and second toes. Motor supply, peroneus longus, and muscles of the anterior compartment of the leg, including the tibialis anterior, extensor helicis longus, extensor digitorium longus, peroneus tertius. Sural nerve, origin, S1 and S2 nerve fibers, it is a branch of the tibial nerve. Course. It arises from the tibial nerve in the popliteal fossa. It descends on the posterior surface of the gastrocnemius. The communicating sural branch communicates with the common peroneal nerve. It courses down alongside the small saphenous vein, posterior to the lateral malleolus. It becomes the lateral dorsal cutaneous nerve along the lateral border of the foot. Sensory supply. Subcutaneous branches supplies the skin on the lateral side of the heel, foot and fifth toe. Operative procedures involving the ankle, calcaneal tendon and the small saphenous vein may injure this nerve. Injury to the nerve is well tolerated, thus it is often used for nerve grafting or biopsy. Saphenous nerve Origin It branches from the deep division of the femoral nerve. It originates from the L3, L4 spinal nerves. Course It causes within the subsartorial canal it contributes to the subsartorial nerve plexus via an infrapatellar branch. It appears posterior to the medial knee after curving behind the sartorius. It descends along the posterior border of the tibia with the great saphenous vein. It passes over the lower aspect of the tibia and emerges anterior to the medial malleolus. It runs along the dorsum of the foot. Sensory supply. Medial knee, medial leg, medial aspect 
of the ankle and foot as far as the first MTP joint, infrapatellar branch supplies the skin in front of the patella. These are my references. Thank you.